Hello everybody, you're welcome back to our 37 info channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to easily assemble your Chiku 22F650 monitor. So first, we're gonna begin with screwing the stand together. So here we have the first part of the stand. As you guys can see, it looks like that. And now let's grab the second one. Here we have two parts, as you guys can see. We need to put them together just like this. So they cover each other. And here we need to hold it. And we need to grab the screw that we have received in the package. So now let's grab it like that. And here we need to enter our screw. Now let's screw this ourselves for the first a couple of screws. Now we can use a screwdriver. As you guys can see, it's the Phillips one. Now let's just put it inside and keep on spinning until we mount it successfully or until we feel the pressure coming from the stand. So as you guys can see, now it's stable it's not moving so now the stand itself is ready and what we can do next is we can let me put the stand aside let's grab the monitor and here we will have the space to place it so now let's get the stand ready and i'll show you guys how to easily do that so first we need to put it perfectly on it and here it might take a couple of tries eventually you guys will get it and you will hear a sound coming as you guys can see now it's holding and it's stable so here we have the first part ready and now all that's left to do is use the cables that we have gotten so the first one is an adapter to actually plug it inside the monitor so let me turn the monitor and here as you guys can see we have a lot of it so it will be the last one the first from the right side this is for our power now it's plugged in and what we need to do next is grab the power supply and here as you guys can see we need to plug it inside our power adapter and now plug this into the power so now after you plugged it into the power it should change the, its color to blue and now it should be ready but it's not the end of it now we need to grab our last cable and we need to plug the hdmi cable right here on the left side basically here now let's plug it and now the second one goes for our graphics card or a laptop that has the hdmi port so i'll see you guys once i plug it So as you guys can see now the monitor is plugged in and we can easily use it so as you guys can see we can create something here for example we can create a new folder and as you guys can see our monitor displays literally everything. So that's it for the video I hope it was helpful if it was then leave a like subscription and a comment and I'll see you in the next one.